The North Dakota Department of Transportation is always looking for new ways to manage the state's highway system efficiently. This also includes managing a culvert and pipe system, which provides an avenue for water to flow under and away from roadways. Culvert inspection is an important step in highway management and allows DOT personnel a way to get a thorough look inside these structures to visually evaluate their condition. Some new tools are being used to assist in these inspections, and although it might look like fun and games, these inspection devices can collect and provide important information that is useful in evaluating a pipe's condition. Currently, the department utilizes one large pipe crawler, the Pierpoint P350 crawler system, along with a number of smaller RC vehicles, better known as Hydraulic Inspection Vehicle Explorers, or HIVES which are used in the districts to assist with inspections across the state. Materials and research engineer Matt Linneman says these tools can provide valuable information that will assist in the overall planning process. And so uh, by knowing what our condition is, we can plan projects accordingly. And so we can avoid costly change orders during construction because we didn't know what the conditions were. Or we can avoid uh, maintenance issues that might come up after the, after project's done. Not only do these crawlers help in the inspection process because they are on a GIS-based system, it is easy to organize the information for immediate access or the information can be used at a later date to track changes in condition over time. Once the information is gathered, it will be available to the personnel who need it most, says transportation engineer Aaron Perez. I think having data is always a good thing. Um, being able to look back and see pictures and videos to see these things. I mean, it's just, it's just having more knowledge of something that we really haven't had. Perez says the inspection devices can traverse the entire pipe and gives them a clearer picture to help assess the overall condition of the structure. It's hard to judge a pipe by what you see on the outside, I think is the biggest part of it. I think a lot of times you can see, um, you, you can see the outside of the pipe uh, on the inlet and outlet and make a judgment call of the whole thing, and that's usually not the case. I think you'd be able to go in and see the whole, traverse the whole inside of the pipe and decide what kind of an issue you actually have. Um, so you can't really judge a book by its cover. The plan is to put one of the smaller hive units into the hands of each district to assist with the inspection process. And Linneman says not only is it a cost-effective way to do inspections, its uses are endless. I would say we've already seen cost savings uh, from some of the inspections, the handful of limited inspections that we've done. We've already identified pipes that need uh, replacement or rehabilitation that we otherwise wouldn't have known of. The use of these pipe inspection devices is just one of the cost-effective tools being implemented to help NDDOT better manage the state's transportation system.